Hello again and welcome to a very special edition of this week's Las Vegas Home Feature Presentation. I'm your host Michael Soto and Brad Balstead and the home we have for you today is located in the Lamplight Estates community. It is a five bedroom, six bathroom home. It's one of the biggest we've seen so far and we are excited to show it to you. So let's go take a look. All right. Uh, as always, this is a 360 video, which means if you are watching on your phone through YouTube or Facebook, you can look around freely, up, down, left, right, pause the video, look around at your own leisure. And if you're using a desktop or laptop, you can click and drag and look all around. Make sure to use uh, Google Chrome or the YouTube app on your phones or Facebook will work as well. All right, so we obviously have this beautiful grand entryway, probably one of the finest we've seen so far with a beautiful chandelier and a uh, uh, setting. Yeah, great all hardwood, hardwood staircase, chandelier, it's got the nice flowers here in the entryway. It really makes you feel at home when you come in. Welcome. Alright, so we're going to start off with the left side of the home because there is an entire left wing of the house we would love to show you. Yes. So let's head over this way. You notice the hardwood floors here on, under our feet. Alright, the first thing, first off we're going to take you is the bathroom. In case anyone has to go. <laughs> Alright, and the first and probably the smallest bedroom. Yep. But guess what? Even though this is the smallest bedroom, it still has its own bathroom. Yep. We don't call it a bedroom. We're going to call it a mini suite. Matter of fact, I believe all the bedrooms, almost all the bedrooms in this home have their own bathroom. Yes. Right. That is correct. All right. Now we'll head right next to that, adjacent to that room. We have this room here. It could be a bedroom. Definitely a bonus room. Definitely a bonus room. It does not have a closet, so we cannot technically tell you it's a bedroom, but large enough for a bedroom. Definitely, no doubt. It has its own intercom system throughout the house as well. Yep. Just like to point that out, being the electrician that I am, I have to point those things out. A little further down the hall here, we have this great office space. Oh yeah, it's gorgeous. You can definitely make this into a den. It also leads outside to the pool area, the patio pool area. Yep. It's a covered patio just outside the uh, two glass doors. More than enough room in here for desks, tables, chairs, whatever you want. Now, if we're going too fast, feel free to hit the pause button and look around freely. That You can do that at any time during this video. Anytime, that's right. All right, now we're going to go right through the center of this uh, yeah. beautiful entryway. We and make our way under the catwalk and around this beautiful flower arrangement. You can see we have the formal living room here. Uh, lots of big windows. Plenty of natural sunlight comes in through those windows. Yes, it's absolutely gorgeous. A great place to sit. Plenty of natural light. You get the feels. The feels. The feels. And of course, the formal dining room. I like how the formal dining room, it is separated with the railing and the wall over here, but it still feels open and whole. You can see the whole house from just about anywhere. Absolutely. All right, we'll take you into this chef-inspired kitchen. And I say chef-inspired because it's really got some good hardware in here, guys. Uh, I gotta tell you, this stove, is one of a kind, or maybe not one of a kind, but it, absolute masterpiece. Uh, and it is just, if you like cooking, that's where you do it. Yeah, we got the six gas range burners, got the hood over the top. As you can see, it's GE, so built to last just about forever. For sure. We also have a dishwasher on this side, trash compactor. We got the garbage disposal in the sink. Plenty of cabinets and cupboard spaces, you can see, and lots of uh, counter space as well. Plenty of counter space, even in the dining room. Here's yep. another dining area. Yep. We have a little kitchenette just off of the, the kitchen with even more covered space in it. All right, and we'll head down into living space. All right, so this living, spa uh, living space features a custom uh, fireplace. It's got lighting in it. It also has uh, it's gas, so I mean, it's really, really nice, really well done. Yes. Very vegas -y, if, yeah. uh, if I do say so myself. It makes a beautiful centerpiece for this room. Absolutely. All right, should we show them outside or should we show them upstairs? Yeah, let's go outside. All right, right, why not? It's a great looking backyard, so we might as well see it. Okay, here we go. All right, now the first thing you notice, I'm pretty sure, is that beautiful pool. We also have a full outdoor kitchen on this side. Um, so I'm gonna swing you around over here to the patio area and we'll get a good look at this pool. It's got a diving board which I'm excited about. Yeah. You can see it's a nice, large covered patio here. And up top we have a balcony, which we'll see closer to the end of this video. Plenty of palm trees and beautiful uh, greenery around. Yep, pretty private. And then back behind that wall on the other side of the outdoor kitchen is a huge RV parking pad. You could probably fit two in there at least. Absolutely. 
or a boat, or pretty much a bunch of toys. Or jet skis, all right. Yeah. Whatever else you play with on the weekend, you can fit it all right here. And show you what I mean, how big this area is. It is big. Yeah. So feel free to look around. It is. Right. He's at the halfway point. Look how far away I am. I'm following you now. <laughs> yeah. And on the other side of it is the very large driveway that leads into the three-car garage. Yes, it is very big. And you get a little view of the neighborhood here. You can see there's a park, tennis courts, lots of beautiful homes. It's a fantastic setting. Spinning you guys around. Sorry about that. All right, we'll make our way back inside the home. Backwards where we came. Should we hit the basement before the second floor? I think we should hit oh. the basement. All right, so if you're wondering what that little staircase right there is, that is something special. This is the basement. One of the very few basements that I've seen myself personally in Las Vegas. Yes, not a whole lot of basements, and this one is a beauty. Oh, this one. Uh, I'm not sure what they got on the East Coast, but I'd imagine it probably doesn't compare to this. <laughs> I'm from the East Coast. It, coast. it doesn't. So, as you can see, you're probably thinking, what? There's windows. Yes, natural light is coming into this basement from the, uh, from the top. That's correct. So, uh, it's got hookups for a wet bar here, no doubt. Uh, so, uh, you can set that up as soon as you move in. Uh, obviously, a great place for gaming. Uh, it's got a little carpeted area for some living space. Um, and like I said earlier, they've got your natural light that comes through those windows. But that's not all. Oh, that's not all. Also on this floor, we have a full bathroom, so you never have to leave the basement yes. if you, if duty calls. For sure. You wouldn't want to walk up those extra stairs. Yeah. We also have a great storage area back here. For sure. Yes. Great. I imagine this is where you put all the extra beer. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't fit in the keg right here. Right. So, now we're going to go head up the beautiful staircase. Yes. Certainly one of my favorite staircases that I have seen here in Vegas for sure. It's got these nice white wood banisters. Really complements it well. Absolutely. The master is on the left side, so we're actually going to go to the right here. I'll leave the mat to the left. Let's take these guys over real quick. Yeah. Get a good view of the home. See what that looks like. And then I'm gonna swing you back this way. Here you guys go. And then get a good look at what the channel is. Alright. So you can really see how open this space is. It really is. And this is almost like this catwalk's almost a loft, really. Yeah. Okay. Here, we do have another bedroom. Yes. Mini suite, I should say, because it does have a walk in closet and another bathroom. And another bathroom. Look at that. Just down the hallway here, we have another mini suite. It just keeps getting sweeter and sweeter. A much larger bedroom, as you can see. Complete with its own walk-in closet and full bath. Oh, yeah, this is nice. Absolutely nice. Look at that. Very big closet. Now for the master. Dum -dum -dum -dum. Take a quick, quick walk across the, the catwalk. On the catwalk. Yep. Do your little turn on the catwalk. And here we are. Brings us to the master bedroom. So you see the master, very spacious, quite large. It does have two pretty big sized windows as well as the uh, French doors that lead out to the balcony. And now for my personal favorite part of the house, the master bath. We'll make our way down this hallway past the his and hers walk-in closets. As you can see, they are both very large. Identical. I'm and both Into sides. this beautiful master bathroom. Oh yeah. This is uh, definitely a bathroom for royalty. Yes. It's got the dual vanities. It's got the gold style fixtures against the white cabinets. Full length mirrors. It's got the huge, I think, believe it's a Queen Elizabeth tub. With the uh, feet here on the bottom. The gold accents. 
Yes, it is gorgeous. And a walk in shower. Yeah, yeah, this is pretty sweet. <laughs> this is pretty nice. You don't even need a door, it's so big. Yeah. No water getting over there. No. Nope. Now we'll go check out the backyard off the balcony. And that will just about conclude this tour. Woo, that's a pretty long video. I, I know. Thank you guys for sticking yeah, with thanks us. Yeah, sticking with us. Yes, for those who have made it. Imagine living here. <laughs> yep. Hi. So this is the back balcony. See, we got the large pool, kitchen over there. All right, guys, and again, uh, thank you guys for showing up to our open house. Uh, as always, you can contact us at the information listed below. Or check out my website at www.lasvegasvalleyhomes, the number four sale.com, where you can search for homes on your own. Or www.lasvegashomebuyersclub.com. All right, guys, you guys take care and thanks again.